What's good, homies? We about to be litty, no cap. You found the Madden plug. Now hit that like, hit that subscribe, and turn that naughty bell on. I'm about to put you on. Coin making methods, no money spent tips, budget beats on the 500 bands, 300 bands, 100 bands. Whatever you need, I got you. I got that daily Madden work. Now let's get it. You heard? Another one. I said, hey, yo. I said, hey, yo. No shmoney spank gang. We in a building and you know that. What is shaking, y'all? You really know what time it is, man. Holla at me. If you're new to the channel, man, hit that like, hit that subscribe, and turn that naughty bell to fuck on. We is all the way to fuck. Let you dig you. Already know. With that being said, man, if it's your first time on the channel, man, check it out. I'm about to show you a graph, a graph just like this. And I do this type of graph for every single promo that comes out. And what I'm doing on this graph is I'm looking for budget beasts. And I take those budget beasts and I compare them to the best cards in that position. If not the most expensive cards in that position, I'm here to help you save some chicken, you dig? I said, hey, yo. AKA 13 is we litty of the fruck. Nah, man. Talk to him, man. Yo. Yo, is we using the free tokens, man? If y'all using y'all tokens to get a free joint, comment that joint down in the description, man. I ain't gonna lie to you. I'm being I'm being stingy with mine. I'm being stingy with mine. I usually wait all the way to the end. But yo, I want Dion pause. I want Ted Hendricks pause. You know what I mean? Like I want I want these joints pause. You know what I mean? Like, no cap. But you know how I be. You know how I be. I'm stingy with it. Anyways, I'm cheap. I can't help it. I'm cheap. Anyways. We're going to go over the cards that hopped out today, man. It's only two Jones. You already know how we get down. And we're going to drop a little money method. Get y'all get some paper in your pockets. You feel me? All right, yo. We're going to start off with the with the one Jones. The 92 overall LTD. The Sun got 2.1 milli. Hey, yo. Damn. Now, we are going to compare him to... It's 91 overall, yo. Y'all know how we do. We, 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 we try to get the comparison right. We try to see which one worth more bread. All right, now, we are going to throw in another John right here. We're going to throw in the Brody. Listen, the boy Brian Thomas. Now, he is down. The cheapest I saw, saw him was 292 bands, okay? Don't be out here in the streets getting got. Feel me? They'll catch you slipping easy. Anyways, from left to right, we got the ball. St. Brown, this is the LTD, so I'm going to say LTD, okay? In blue. The regular 91 overall Sun God in red, okay? And then we got Brian Thomas Jr. in green. LTD is going to be 6 foot. St. Brown's going to be 6 foot. And then the ball, Brian Thomas, is going to be 6'3". When it comes to speed, LTD, 92. Sun God and Thomas, both 91. When it comes to acceleration... LTD 93, Sun God and Thomas both 90. When it comes to catching, LTD 91, Sun God 89, Thomas 88. When it comes to short route running, LTD and Brian Thomas both 89, the ball Sun God 91. When it comes to medium route running, LTD 90, Sun God 93, Brian Thomas 88. Deep route running. LTD 93, Sun God and Brian Thomas both 91. Now, is the ball Sun God worth 2.1 million? And is the 91 overall worth 500 bands? Now, listen, they both come with pre lit X Factors. Y'all know how they do. Okay, rack them up, pre lit, aka Route Tech, pre lit, and then wide receiver apprentice pre lit. The difference is going to be how much you pay in AP. For both of them, the rack em up is going to be 1 AP. 
Now the difference where you're gonna see is Route Tech, which is my favorite Route Tech. Y'all already know how we get down. For the LTD, it's gonna be 2AP, 3AP for the regular joint. And then <clears throat> wide receiver apprentice, it's gonna be 1AP for the LTD and 2AP for the wide receiver, uh, for the regular joint. It ain't too bad. But listen, statistically, I flux with these cars. Okay, 90, 92 speed, 91 speed, fire. Okay, 91 is really where we want to be at. You know what I'm saying? 90 minimum. Y'all know how we turn the fuck up. Okay, the difference to me where I see that the, the variance is going to be the 92 spec catch for the LTD when they gave the regular John an 88. You feel me? Like, don't do homie like that. Brian Thomas got a 91 spec catch. Same speed, too. I ain't going to lie to you. The route running on the regular John. Seems to be better Okay 91 For Sun God 91 overall And then 93 I don't know why they do weird like that I don't know EA be weird and, fu and funny like that Don't be acting like baby moms out here in the streets Anyways They they both come with tier 3 abilities You know Slot Apprentice Short in Short out Jukebox <clears throat> Slot matic All the joints you really need Both of these cars is heat I ain't gonna lie to you But they pricey bro For me I'll drop 290 bands for the ball, Brian Thomas, who also, okay, doesn't come with a pre-lit, but he does come with Nightmare matchups, Slot Apprentice, all the way up to two tier two abilities. I frogs with the jaw. No tier three, but 6-3 with a 91 speed? Psh, I don't even need to say more, bro. Stop playing. Now, is we talking money or what? I said, is we talking money or what? Shmoney gang, we in a building and you know that. <laughs> now, for those of you guys that are new to the channel, man, P Game, I'm gonna run through this real fast. Everything here is color coordinated, okay? Now, this gray joint right here, this gray box is gonna be the market based off of mutt.gg. Okay, this green box right here is going to be your snitty types, aka your cheapest valued cards. Okay, now, peep game, all right? Purple is always going to be what you sell at. Yellow is always going to be in profit. Pink is always going to be promo specific. Now, as you can see, we have all the promos broken down. And what we got is that these filter, okay? These all filter into these tabs. And today, we are going to be taking a look at the AKA tab, and this breaks down all the sets. These two charts right here filter into these sets, okay? This is the original chart that you saw in the beginning. Now, on the left column, you're gonna see the overalls, okay? All right, so we're gonna take this 88 for an example, okay? Now, you can see that the min the cheapest 88 overall for this promo, which is AKA, is gonna be 130 bands, okay? Market value for 88 is 84. Um, is 84,000 as you can see according to mutt.gg 88s are going to be are going for 84.2 okay so that's how we know that all right now this this green column is going to show you exactly how much under the market it is as you can see it's not under it's over now um right here you'll see it's over the most expensive 88 is going to be 152k this right column is going to let you know that this 88 is a hundred and eighty percent over the market value and that's how we find some chicken okay now we're gonna be talking about we're gonna be talking about this aka set real quick all right now peep game right peep game for this 88 set what you're gonna need is 884 aka card all right, so as you can see, the 84s are going to be for 16,300. So that means you need eight of these 84 overalls for 16,300. That's going to that's gonna come out to about 130 bands. Don't worry, I got you, right? You can see 6K in profit. This is where things get better for you, okay? You're going to be able to sell these cards, and obviously, the two cards that you're going to want to sell is the 87, I mean, the 88 Stork or the 88. Um, Amon Ross St. Brown. So it's going to be Amon Ross St. Brown or Ted Hendricks. However, whichever one you want to sell. They're both going for about 152K. All right. Now, total set value for the set is going to be 130 bands. You can, that means that this is how much the whole set is going to cost you. It's going to cost you 130 bands. 
You sell it for 152, comes out to 136 after taxes, which only leaves you with about 6K in profit. But I got you, because there's another way you can do this. Now, there's a new set that hopped out today, and you have to come all the way down, and you're gonna see this set that hopped out today is going to be, all right? The 84 Elite Set. You're gonna need three 82s. Now, there's money in this set if you just wanna do this one, okay? Now, the way you're gonna do this one is you need three 82s, okay? Now, the cheapest 82s you wanna get for is about 3,500. 3,500 or less, you should have some in your binder just sitting there, okay? If you just wanna make 11 bands, bro, they just sell the 84 overall Joe Klecko right, uh, right end for the Jets. You can sell them for about 24 bands, you'll make 11K in profit, okay? Total set value is going to be 10,000. The beauty of this is that you'll be able to get an 84 from it for 10,000, okay? So now you do that set eight times, okay? That's gonna come out to 84,000, okay? P game. So you got eight of those 84s from doing that set. You put them into this set and boom, I'm gonna show you. Now, instead of spending 130 bands buying them off of the market, P game, you ready for this? Look, you'll be able to make 52,000. But it's gonna take you a little bit longer. You gotta build out the 84s, take the 84s, put them into this set, sell the card at 152K, and then you'll be able to make 50 bands every single motherfucking time. Is we talking money or what? Talk to him. Now, if you guys do wanna do this stork set, now I'm gonna, I'm gonna put you on, okay? If you wanna do this stork set, Yo, you're gonna need about 663k. This is the total set value. Six, about 600 to 700 bands, okay? You're gonna be able to make 47,000 every single time. You know what I mean? So it's not terrible, but I'm gonna show you how to make a little bit more money, okay? Now, you're gonna need the promo specific, right? You're gonna need that player specific, my fault. Player specific, the 88 overall. Now, I just showed you how to do that set. You can do that set for dirt cheap, just like I showed you. Put it into this set unless you want to buy unless you want to buy it off of the uh, auction block. You know what I mean? Boom. You get that joint, and then you're gonna need any 884 AKAs. Again, you can do this set, right? So rather than buying them from the from the auction block, right? Because the auction block is gonna tell you if you need the 88s, the cheapest ones you're gonna find is about 130 bands. Okay, 130 bands times four that comes out to 520. Yo, total set value is going to be wild crazy, right? But peep game, let's say, right? In a hypothetical scenario, right? You build this 88 set out five times, okay? One for the stork and then four other times, okay? The total set value goes down to 481K. Now, the difference is going to be enormous. Look, rather than spend up, you're going to be able to make 228 bands by just building these 88s out. But you gotta build these 88s out for about 80 bands. You feel me? Like, no cap, you gotta build it out. But it's gonna take you a while from building out these 84s. So you gotta be prepared to build out all these 84s, to build all these 88s, to put them into this set, and you'll be able to make some real bread. You feel me? Like some real shmoney, dog. You feel me? We got, we got money methods all day, man. Sub to the fucking channel. We all the way to front lit. You day. Now, let's get back to the car. We're going to finish this last joint off. And then I'm going to go online and go bust some, some AO lie. You feel me? Anyways, man, pause. Now, we're going to go over Ted Hendricks. For those of you guys that don't know, this is a legend. Not only a legend in real life, brodies, but this is a Madden legend. Okay? this Once this car hops out... Everybody go crazy. Even I'm like, yo, I'm about to spend my togas on this. Yo. I don't give a fuck. You know what I mean? Like, but yeah. <laughs> Y'all know me. I like I like buying I like buying dirt cheap. 695k. 600k. 700k. Bro, you know the slogan, man. 700k. We ain't gonna pay. Nah, but shout out, shout out to everybody that's out there mutt balling, man. God bless you, man. May you live a beautiful life, man. You already know, man. But me, 
I'm cheap with it, man. Give me, give me food stamps, you feel me? Give me the EBT card. I'm all the way to front lit, you dig? All right, here we go. We're going to compare the ball. Now, listen. I was looking at this, and he's always someone tough to compare to because his statistics is always wild crazy. He's always going to be the best left outside linebacker in the game when he hops out. Just giving you a disclaimer, okay? So I'm going to find you the best possible option, okay? And to me, that option is going to be LeVon Kirkland. He's a free 91 overall from the field pass, but you have to fully upgrade him, okay? Now, we from left to right, we got the ball, Ted Hendricks in blue, okay? The Mad Stork. Six fucking seven. Hey yo, what the fuck? And then we got the ball, Levon Kirkland in red. He is six one. When it comes to speed, they both eighty nine speed. Acceleration, Stork eighty seven. Kirkland ninety. Strength, Stork eighty eight. Kirkland ninety. Block shed. Man, the ball, Stork, OP, 93, Kirkland with a 90 jump, okay? Power move, Hendricks, 91, Kirkland, 87. Finesse move, Stork, OP, 84, the ball, Kirkland with a super mid, 62. Now, is the ball, Stork, worth 700 bands? Listen, bro, this, the ball is 67. 88 strength, 93 blocks, at 91 power move, 84 finesse move, 77 spec catch, 70 man, 84 zone. Come on, the frog. Hey, yo, what the fuck? The ball all the way lit, bro. But <laughs> he all the way lit. But listen, hold up, hold up. Okay, not only that. But he also comes with pre-lit X factors. He comes with dual through dual threat for four AP. Lurk artist one AP and reinforcement. They get a ball dual threat and reinforcement and lurk artist. You're trying to break the game, man. The only thing that they fucked up, bro, is if they would have made him a 91 speed, like a 90 speed, this dude would have been cracked, man. But for the most part, he all the way lit. I fucked with this card. Probably the best card out right now, truthfully. Anyways, man. X Factors is lit. He comes with all the way up to the tier three abilities. Double or nothing. Defensive rally. No outsiders. Pick artists. Unpredictable. Uh, come on, man. The, the ball got everything. Now, look at the ball Kirkland, though. 89 speed. 90 strength. 90 block set. 87 power move. 62 finesse move, though. You feel me? But the ball also does have... A 79 zone, 59 men. So those are those are tight mid, you know what I mean? But he also comes all the way with tier three abilities. No pre-lit X factors though. No outsiders, lurk artists, double or nothing, defensive rally, reach elite. You know what I mean? Like he, he got some jones to fruck switch, you know what I mean? So honestly, man, if you can't afford this store card, man, the ball Kirkland will hold it down for you. Anyways, man, if this video helped you out. Hit that like, hit that subscribe, turn that naughty bell to fuck on your dick. <laughs>